up everyone, Bando here with another video of mine. And today, I'm gonna have a quick video to show you guys how to um, convert these, convert flight test plans into foam and cut out foam, nice foam board into um, a model plane. So let's go here and transition into my computer. So I have an open tab here. And there's many ways you could do this. The first way is to go to store.flighttest.com. Ooh, look at that Labor Day savings start now. Ooh, fun. And then you want to go to home, top brands. Let's actually full screen this. Top brands, and then you scroll down to flight test. And then after that, you have all these certain plays that we all know and love. I want to build the FT Sportster. So I'm here. And I have all the information here, like what you need, the prop size and all that. Where are the plans? I wonder. Optional parts, I mean resources. And then you have the full plans and the tiled plans. So the difference between those two plans is that the full plans is basically... Actually, let's download this. The full plans is just the large plans that's usually used for, um, like if you're laser cutting or anything. <coughs> so... As you can see, everything is really big here. Look at that boob, really big. It's everything is in full scale. But if you're like me and you have, if you and you only have a printer paper, then what you have to do is see there's the different sheets. And what you do is basically tape them together, which I'll show you guys later. But basically you want to print this out. This is all the plans. It's all like cut out into individual pieces of paper. And then you'll have to um, combine those later on. So once you have that, that's one way you can get it. Another way is just go to flight, flighttest.com. If I can, okay, that still works. And you can scroll down to latest build plans. And you can also just go more build plans. Hmm, let's build a sports, sportster. Ooh, look at this, FD Sportster build. You go to the build, and boom, all the plans are here. So you have the all-in-one, which includes the full and tiled, and you also have the full or tiled. So we can go back here. Now I'll show you guys what not to do. You do not want to just like, ooh, let's press the print button. Don't do that, it's bad, because Google Chrome sometimes format things differently and change the size and all. So the first thing I like to do, at least, is to go ahead and download, um, What's it called? Adobe... Adobe Acrobat. I've... Of course, I don't have Adobe Acrobat on. Okay, now you have it opened up here. As you can see, it looks a lot nicer. It's easier to see what everything looks like. And then you can go to the print section. If it allows. Okay, why are you s okay, okay, sorry. Um, <coughs> you want all of it? Um, this really doesn't matter. You can do whatever you want. It literally is the same thing. But shrink oversized pages? No, custom scale to 100, please. So, yeah, this is the settings you need to do, and then you just basically press, um, print. And, yeah. Um, what's good about these plans is that it could go, go you could print it in black and white. I like to print it in color though, just cause it looks nicer and it's kind of easier to read, but it should, you should still be able to be able to, um, identify the different kind of lines and score cuts. So I'm going to go ahead and print that out. And then once I have that printed out, probably tomorrow or maybe I will, um, show you guys how to, uh, Cut it, cut everything out, and then combine it using tape, and taking that into actually cutting it, cutting your template onto um, foam board. So yeah, see you guys real soon.